Hello everyone. I have not been doing this in a while. I haven't made a video, especially not on the Old Republic for quite some time. Uh, specifically, you know, the MMO Old Republic. So it's been a minute. This is my character. Uh, well, not really my main character, but my character. Nonetheless, not important. Not the point of this video. We're going to talk about this stronghold because I feel like it. Um, this is the Rishi stronghold. I think it's super cool. I think it was like 26 million to upgrade no 18 million i think to completely buy and and get all the rooms for and stuff like that and uh as you see here it's got uh 75 slots i mean 75 players can hang out here which i think is pretty cool and it's got 12 different rooms that we're going to go through in this video just take a look at it's not decorated yet because i am super poor right now um i did spend a little bit of money uh on my attire the I spent 80 million on just the clothing and I don't even want to talk about how much I spent on the on the saber and the crystal so let's just not let's just move on <laughs> let's just move on from that point uh so this is a pvp stronghold which okay like if you're if you're in my channel you know why I bought this I'm a pvp person uh and so when you come here you are automatically toggled for pvp um I'm sure you can probably turn that off somewhere but as of right now uh, I don't know where. And you can, like, close the gates and stuff like that if you go here. Uh, and the gates will lock in here, and it'll it'll lock you in. And anyone who's in here is, like, flagged for PvP, so you can be in here, like, you know, fighting it out, and, like, you know, doing your thing or whatever. So I think that's pretty cool. Uh, you can go over here and turn it off. Um, so also, also... There's like a spectator area over here where you can like watch people who are battling and stuff like that down on the ground, um, which I think is pretty neat. Uh, let's go back through here. Also over there, you can like sync your item level or your, your you can sync your level and your item level to 75, which is why I have 282,000 health. Uh, you can turn that off. Let me turn that off really quick actually. Oh wait, can I turn it off? Wait, how do I turn it off? Whoa, that's, oh sick. What is this, a spectator view? What is this? What is this? Oh, that's dope. Can I like... Oh, that's... I didn't know that I could do... I actually did not know I could do that. That's pretty cool. That means that if I ever want to like host tournaments or anything here, I can totally do that. Sick. All right. Well, let me disconnect real quick so I can continue showing this stronghold. So again, a part of the reason I'm making this video is because I've actually never seen people go through a lot of the stuff that this place offers. Just like they show an overview and they kind of like move along. But I'm going to show off what this place offers, going through each room one by one, and um, just letting you guys get a good view of it. Also, I hope the frame rate is good. Um, this game um, sometimes has an issue getting solid 60 FPS, but I think that my GPU can probably, and, and CPU can probably handle this game. It's, like 10 years old at this point and you know happy 10 year anniversary um old republic you've been a great game for 10 years and um yeah hopefully 10 more will come along so let's see this is the uh sun room you can put whatever you want in here you can like look up and like see stuff going on up there um i don't know what i'm gonna put in here i don't even know if i'm gonna use this room if i'm honest like i just bought it to fill out the entire place but yeah, it's a nice circular room that you can fill up with like whatever you want. You can make a casino in there or some shit if you want. Um, and we can go over here if we want. There's stuff down here we can check out. I can decorate this however. Uh, I'm not going to go into like the hooks. Well, I might. Hold on. There's no reason not to, right? So like these are the hooks. So as you can see, you can put whatever you want over here um, within the range of the hooks. Like if you've done any sort of like decorating with your republic you'll see that you know you can put whatever you want in these places like you you know what to expect with decorating i'll just leave the hooks on as i'm running around so that you can like see them i'm not going to go into any fine detail about what's everywhere because like i'm not super into decorating actually um i've never decorated a stronghold so this is going to be my first challenge my first stronghold to decorate um and so yeah um there's this area and I really like this area because it, it just looks like a little town, right? Like, you could set up all types of stuff here and have NPCs walking around like they live around in this area. Um, 
and like whatever just like there's all types of furniture items that would be really cool to place here um, and i think this is a large spot so like i could put well maybe not a large i don't know what like fairly large spot i guess so you can like put a pretty large item here put like some posters on this thing over here and like all types of crazy stuff around here oops hopefully that didn't burn your retinas uh, <laughs> um this is a really nice area maybe like a a council room or like a I don't know what I would put here. Something cool. I don't know. <laughs> I don't have enough imagination, which is part of why my videos have been so uh, few and far between. But we're not going to discuss that. Not the point of this video. Uh, so more stuff over here you can decorate. Lots of places on the wall. I mean, like if you don't like the rusty aesthetic, then this is not the stronghold for you. Um, but if you like that, if you like that sort of like I might get tetanus at any moment, sort of aesthetic. If you're a PvP or you're used to that aesthetic. Um, but if you do like that aesthetic, you know, this is definitely the place for you. So we're gonna hit the speeder. Oh, wait. There we go. So now we're gonna just like take a quick overview of the places we've looked at. And don't worry, we're not done. We're not even close to done. There's a lot more stuff for you to explore, for you to look at in this video before you sign off. Hey that disc is flying by. Um so yeah. Also as you can see, there's like a little beach area that you can explore and all this water and stuff like that. Look at that. Check this out. All right. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's check out the... Wait. Wait. Are we at the hideout? No, no, no. Okay. So we're not going to take the, the speeder because that'll, that'll like take us back to where we just came from. And I don't want to have to like edit that out of this video because that's like time I could spend doing something else. But we're going to take a jump over here. I love how my lightsaber is just like scraping along the ground. Let's, let's, you know, there you go. Let's fix that. Okay. So, so as you can see, there's like a whole beach area over here. We can put like a, a sick, um, look at this. Oh, I could put an airship right here. This is a large spot. I could put like a whole spaceship right here. Just like point it however I want. This can be like the point of arrival, you know, you can like crash land on a, on a beach. It'd be sick. And we're not done. We're still not done. We are still not done. There's so much. This is the most massive house, house in heavy quotation, stronghold I've seen in any game. Like, this is pretty ridiculous. Um, look at this. Pretty sick, right? You got like a, a hidden conclave back here. It's crazy. And we're still not done. <laughs> but wait, there's more. So hold on. We go through here. Where's the elevator at? There it is. Oh, almost squished me. Okay. Up we go. Come on. Sweet. It's like it's like we're in like the bat cave. Sick, right? Alright, check this out. We got like a whole secret room back here that we can chill out in. Take a left, take a right, uh, take another left or right over here. Look at this. Like these could be like bedrooms or like training rooms, barracks or something like that. Go over here, you got like a nice office space. Come out here and have like your secret like back back alley place look at that and there's like spots up on top of this thing that they, that you can decorate that's so freaking oh jesus christ so that's that's a problem with the old republic right i don't know if it's my mouse or what but like sometimes the camera will like snap in random directions and if that happens i'm sorry if it makes you a little sick i it makes me a little sick too so i'm not doing it on purpose i apologize okay so that's kind of that we're still not done don't worry we're not done um but this shows like this like some of the stuff now let's check out the other portions real quick. Let me type slash stuck so I can get back to the beginning. Alrighty. Now check this out. Check out this. This is like the best part right here. Like this is the the piece de resistance as they say. You know what I'm saying? Check this out. Wait, did I go to the wrong place? I probably did. All right, check this out. Check this out. Sick. You see that airship? We're flying up to the airship. We got a whole airship instead of like they give you a house and they give you an airship just to like hang out in. Check this out. Sick. All right. So we're going to go this way. Going to go into this room. We got like a reactor core. Well, there's like a reactor room, but I don't have a reactor core to put in here yet. But I'm going to put one. It's going to be sick. It's going to be like the sickest reactor, like right here. It's going to be dope. Right. All right. Cool. I mean, there's nothing here yet. So there's not much I could talk about other than the fact that like. There's a lot of cool stuff I could put in here. Also, I want to point out 
that this place has something like 1600 slots for items right like i think it's the most in the entire game right i don't think that there's any other strongholds that have as much space as this thing this is a training room so like if you want to come in here and practice your rotation on like a dummy you can go over to this computer and uh you can summon like a training dummy to smack around which is great like that's like one of my favorite things to do in mmos like, outside of even like doing combat i like to just hit a striking dummy for like hours and hours on end and like i swear to god i'm not even being ironic i will happily do that for a long time oops didn't mean to do that so this is like a port quarters you know you can like put like beds and stuff in here and just kind of like chill out just like decorate however you want and we're gonna go cross over here real quick as you can see, there's like, there's a lot of space. There's a ton of space. And again, this is 18 million credits, which if you're playing the Old Republic right now, currently, um, inflation is ridiculous right now. And so 18 million credits is like literally nothing. Honestly, you'll spend way more money decorating this entire thing. Now this is the really cool spot. Check out this, this is the, the bridge of the ship, right? So we got like all of this stuff going on in here and stuff that could be going on in here if i had any money to decorate with and look at this this is like the part that really got me like check this out like it gives you this like illusion of motion like it like, like as if the ship is like really flying around i mean it is within the confines of the game but like obviously it's not physically moving right we're not physically moving it's like an illusion it's pretty sick so ooh, whoa lag all right so i got one more cool thing to show you and then we're gonna peace out. So hang on to your butts, everybody. It's gonna be sick. I think you're gonna really like this. I was saving it for last just because I think y'all deserve to see something cool. It's been a minute since I've made anything for my channel, so I think y'all deserve something a little bit cool, you know what I'm saying? Oh wait, hide the hooks, sky deck. Check this out. We're going up to the sky deck. Check this out right here. Yo, check it out. Look at this. This is the sky deck. And like, okay, this is pretty big. This is pretty big, right? Pretty big. Pretty big place. Look at this. Pretty huge, right? Well, there's a whole thing back there. There's a whole direction over here. This is a whole zone, basically. Like, look at this. And this is a PvP area. So like, if you just want to have a giant brawl out here, you can do that. You can just like, have a humongous like, team fight in this area. You can have like a 16v16 if you want. Look at this, pretty sick. I don't even know what a lot of this stuff is. Oh, that's awesome. What the hell? That's cool as fuck. All right, so yeah. These are like some of the cool things you can put out here. And you can actually play hut ball here. Like, let me check. Let me, uh, let me show you that real quick. Let me show you some hut ball. Listen up. These are the rules of hut ball. Duty. Look at that. And it spawns the hut ball right here. Huts don't have feet. Show our sponsor Yorada the respect he deserves. So yeah. So yeah, if, if you know, if, if you are a huge fan of Hutball or whatever, you can like come in here, play a match of Hutball with your friends without having to deal with like pre-made groups on the other team that are like ruining your fun. <laughs> totally not speaking from experience. And uh, yeah, you can just have a good time. Hold on, let me see if I can like pick a team real quick. Yeah, I'm on the Rotworms. Spawn some more Hutball. Okay, I probably shouldn't have done that because now you gotta... Oh yeah, okay, cool, cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already heard it. Baron Deathmark. Whoops. I'm pretty sure that's a glitch. I feel like that's not supposed to be possible. What happens if I just fall off? That would suck, right? Okay, so I can, like, totally just, like, play some, like, the saddest game of hot ball known to man. Can I? Let me grab the ball. 
Yeah, yeah, Rotworm got the ball. Let's go. We're going to win this for the Rotworms. Let's go. We're going to get a score real quick just to like see how it all works. I've never actually done this before. And then uh, we're going to, uh, you know, <laughs> show the front of the ship and then we're going to end the video. The Boom. Look at that. We're scoring. Let's go. <laughs> all right. That was cool. So, yeah, hut ball. Yeah. Sick. Just going to go over here and end the match. All right, Rotworms win. Let's go. All right, let's see now. So this is also the front of the ship. Um, and look at that beautiful sun. Um, and you can like you can go even higher in just a second. I just want to show this off real quick. There's a lot of stuff over here. You can decorate all this stuff as well. And um, now we're gonna take this big lift real quick. We're gonna go up this lift. To the top of the top of the ship and look at that beautiful view you can just like hang out here with your friends play some hut ball do some pvp the way pvp is meant to be experienced you know just as a as a friendly enjoyable experience nobody's getting so well people are getting salty but that's fine it's pvp you're supposed to get salty you know it's whatever right but you're all still friends it's all good so yeah i just wanted to show this off um, if you enjoy the video, make sure you like and subscribe and do all that stuff. I'm going to be doing some New York Public content because i got a lot of time now. Uh, I graduated from college recently, so I am free to do whatever I want, which means that I will procrastinate videos even more frequently. So with that in mind, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next video, no matter what that may be. Peace.